Hey, my name is Attorney Walter Wolf, not the third with Disability Resolution PA. What we're going to be doing is going over a wonderful, wonderful thing called a quarter of coverage. Let's go through it. In 2004, in order to earn a quarter of coverage, you would need to earn $900 in income. You're there with a shovel, you're there with a mop, you're earning it, all right? And pay federal taxes on it. So you're going to earn the money, you're going to pay the taxes, you get one quarter of coverage. You repeat this over and over, you're allowed to get up to four per year. If you get enough of these wonderful little, you can call them quarters of coverage, you can call them coins, you can call them credits, you can call them QCs, I don't really care. If you get enough of these, you get what's called a DFI, day first insured, because you now have enough for your age to be insured. If you do not keep up with the working, you will get what's called a DLI, date last insured. Date last insured means you have not been earning enough quarters of coverage for the age, because as you get older, you need more. And so you have your date first insured, you have your date last insured. That is your insured period. So between there and there, insured period. So long as you are found, okay, disabled under the Social Security Disability Program, you have the potential, if found disabled during that insured period, to go on to what's called Social Security Disability Insurance. Okay, that's your Title II, RSDI, Social Security Disability Insurance program. We're not talking about, we are not talking about supplemental security income, which is your title 16 based wonderful poverty program. All right. My name is attorney Walter Roof, not the third. I'm with disability resolution PA in Orlando, Orange County based social security disability law firm. Let's go ahead and go on to the next one. 2005. In 2005. Oh, wait a minute. We're going to go ahead and end the video there because we're going to do another video. So anyway, if you have a unique question for your unique claim, give me a call. If you want the most up-to-date information, give me a call also. Uh, you don't have to be a client to give me a call. I'll still help you out. And finally, um, blah, blah, blah. If you would like me to make a video about a particular legal topic, that's fine. I can do that. I'll explain it to you and we'll go from there. All right. I hope all is well. I'll catch you later. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.